Hello and welcome to the Telescope. Every week we'll bring you a fresh insight from the biggest car market in the world. I was at the 2023 Guangzhou Auto Show to check out the Xpeng X9 and the Li Auto Mega. But as you can see, there are too many people and this is on the press day. God knows what it's like on public reception day. So I'm going to have to switch to footage shot by my colleagues or on the case of the Li Auto Mega, official press images. But I've seen these cars in person. Here are my thoughts. This is the x X9, a massive MPV that kind of looks like a spaceship. It probably doesn't look very big in video, but trust me, it's actually not that much smaller than the Li Auto Mega coming up later. In terms of space, it's broadly comparable to the Volvo EM90 or the Zika 009 we reviewed before, but its third row can be completely folded into the rear floor by holding down a button. Even the headrest is electrically powered. When we were filming the car, the x employee was constantly asked to fold up the seat and unfold the seat. It definitely looks very impressive. What's even more impressive is the packaging. x manages to jam a third row seat like this, which takes up just about all the space behind the rear axle, dual chamber air suspension and rear wheel steer, while not compromising safety. The x X9 can pass the 70% overlap rear impact test at 88 km an hour. The impact speed in the Federal Motor Vehicle Safety Standards 301R is 79.2 km an hour. So x didn't cut corners on safety. In fact, the only compromise we can see is the X9 is a predominantly front-wheel drive car because it cannot have a big rear motor. But on an MPV, we're not looking for any tail-happy driving pleasure. So I think we can live with that. On the inside, the biggest highlight is the 21-inch TV. It is significantly bigger than the 17 or the 15-inch TV on other MPVs, and it has a remote onto the Li Auto Mega. The biggest selling point is in its name. It's mega huge. So big, in fact, the rear door has to be separated into two pieces, otherwise the boot cannot be easily accessible in a standard-sized parking space in China. This car was just on display, but reliable sources told me it has a third row that has not been seen ever before in an MPV, and this source is 6 foot 5. Notice how big the third row window is? With a car this huge and being pure electric, Lioto has to pull out all the stops in efficiency, hence this extremely simple and pure design. It is perhaps the closest shape you can get to a perfect teardrop while maintaining interior space. I accused Lioto for not taking enough risks before, but they are risking everything on this body style. And by the evidence we have seen so far, they will likely pull this off and develop a family of teardrop-shaped, extremely efficient pure electric MPVs. Yes, there will be smaller versions of the Mega coming later next year. It has two motors, 544 horsepower and 5.5 seconds to 100 km an hour. Battery capacity is 102 kilowatt hour usable, with a drag coefficient of just 0.215, that's the lowest of any MPV ever produced. It should have a range of roughly 700 km CLTC. The more impressive aspect is the charging speed. It can charge up to 520 kilowatts, which means it can put enough energy to run 520 kilometers CLTC cycle in just 12 minutes. Of course, that's on Leoto's own ultra fast chargers, but they are putting a lot of these into the highway service areas in China. We should get to drive off the x X9 by the end of 2023, where the Mega is likely to be in January. If you're wondering why are Chinese brands building this many MPVs, Check out our review on the Zika 009 where I went in-depth on the very different perceptions of MPV in East Asia. Publicly, these two cars are seen as rivals, but actually the Li Auto Mega is at least half a class bigger than the x X9. It's reflected in the price as well. x opened for pre-orders on the Guangzhou Auto Show with a starting price of just $54,000. And the Li Auto Mega is projected to be just below $83,000 with every options ticked. The two cars also have very different emphasis on space, practicality, agility and design. We'll have a closer look on these two massive luxury electric MPVs in their own test drive. That is all from the telescope today. If you enjoyed this video, keep watching, keep subscribing. More videos coming along very soon.